Okay, so I just plugged, I just plugged it in, and you can already see um, that the microphone can pick up my voice, and it's it's just really sensitive. Um, I'll probably end up tweaking it just because uh, when I take this thing outside on a bicycle, uh, the sounds are going to be so loud that it'll probably max this thing out, and go all the way to the tip. Um, so I'm also planning on, right now I have a strip of 120 LEDs. I'll probably cut these ones off and then just adjust the number of LEDs that I'm um, setting in the code. So let me turn on some music really quick and we'll see how this responds. <laughs> So right now, it's actually too sensitive. Um, the nice thing is I can set the threshold in the code. So music at this volume, you know, once I tweak it, it'll be reaching about right here. And it's gonna take like a really loud bass thump to kick it all the way up to the top. But yeah, I'm just really satisfied with uh, Adafruit's products. And then finally, what I'm going to do, eventually I'm going to mount it onto the back of this bike here. And this bike is freaking awesome. It's got a 24 volt, like 10 amp battery. Um, basically, uh, you charge it right here. And this just is a regular, um, you know, AC plug. You just charge plug that right into the wall um, but this thing can go like it has a little throttle right here so you can either have it on this straight throttle and you can go like 15 miles an hour which is kind of fast for a pedal bike um, or you can put it on a uh, pedal assist and that way you don't do anything with the throttle but while you're pedaling it'll give you kind of like a boost um, and another thing, like this came with one battery, but it has a slot for another battery. Um, totally awesome bike. Uh, the one drawback is it's so freaking heavy. Like I can barely like pick up the back. I think it's like 80 pounds or something. Um, but yeah, that's about it.